How did he respond? It's Hot 101.5 with Miguel and Holly. Who is Lauren, and what is this lie she told her boyfriend, Holly? So uh, when they first got together and she would spend the night at his place, uh, if she drinks a lot, she wets the bed. Mm -hmm. And I don't know if it's just when she drinks a lot. I I don't remember. It doesn't help, though. It doesn't help. It increases it. Right. Uh, she has some some bladder issue. Uh, Overactive so it may, bladder, It may said. also happen at other times, but the drinking doesn't help. So mm -hmm. anyway, uh, the first time it happened, she was so embarrassed. She was like, oh, oh, my God, the dog. It was your dog who sleeps with us. Well, it's happened several more times. And so since it worked so well the first time, she blamed the dog subsequent times. Mm -hmm. Now they're about getting ready to move in, and she's going to move in. And he's like, I can't. I can't keep having my dog wet the bed, so I'm just going to give him away to some family members. Oh. So now she's like, oh, God, no, he can't give the dog away. A, it's going to make me feel bad. Yes. And then as we all pointed out, the peeing's not going to stop. Mm -hmm. So, And we are live right now on the Miguel and Holly and the Hot 101.5 Facebook page. So I got this message last night from Lauren because okay. she did decide to come clean to him about her being the one that pees the bed. Which she was going to have to do. Yeah. I'm sorry. That, that's just what was going to have to happen. Here's what she said. I did it. I, for the first time in my life, looked someone I know in the eyes and said that sometimes when I'm drunk, I pee the bed. I have an overactive bladder. That's a big step. I told my boyfriend he doesn't have to get rid of his dog when we move in together. Ooh. He started crying. Oh. I was so confused. I went to hug him and ask, what did I say that upset you? He then said that he's so relieved that he doesn't have to get rid of his dog. He loves me so much. He then told me how right after college, he got into a lot of debt and made some really bad investments with family money from who he thought were mentors of his. He shut himself away from his family and friends because he was so embarrassed for losing money from them. The only thing that kept him alive during that time was his dog. Oh, dear. He promised to always make sure that his dog would have the best life possible. Oh. So it was going to really pain him to leave his dog with his parents. I felt even more like an a-hole for lying to him this entire time. We talked some more about trust and how we need to be open about mm -hmm. everything. This was one of the hardest things I've had to do, but I'm so glad I came clean. Thank you for the advice. Look at that, Lauren. You know. Honesty is the best policy. Adult conversations. Right. And I think, too, this is a perfect example of how if you don't communicate with your partner, yes. you never get the full story. Yeah. He's has this whole story that now she's just learning about his past that she had no clue about. Right, and when would he have maybe even said that? Right, like, that's not something that just comes up in casual conversation, but now they know. Yeah. And now he knows her big secret, and it's like they can bond over that, and now that they've both been vulnerable with each other. You got yes. each other's backs. Yes, it's like you're in it together. It's you against the world. Man, I, w I got nervous. I got nervous when you said he started crying, because I was like... I know, I was like, oh. <laughs> but this is, I mean, this is the best way this could have possibly worked out. Absolutely. So Ooh. I'm so happy for Lauren and her boyfriend. That I'm they happy for the dog. Yeah, same. <laughs> okay, fine. I mean, it's not like they were going to put the dog on the street. I mean, no. the dog was going with his parents. Right, but that's that's a happy ending. A family member. I mean, it doesn't happen that often when there's like an actual... <laughs> <I know. laughs> like a well-thought-out adult conversation that leads to a happy ending. Just goes to show you, just communicate.